Governor Little says ever since the vaccine was made available back in May, the state of Idaho has directed multiple resources to hospitals to help with capacity. Governor Little says the state of Idaho utilized the following resources. New funds will establish three new monoclonal antibody treatment facilities in Idaho. Currently, there are 32 Idaho hospitals administering these life-saving infusions. Up to 370 National Guardsmen were deployed to help hospitals in North Idaho. Seven million was given to hospitals to help relieve staffing shortages. $4.5 million went towards primary care and urgent care facilities. $8.5 million went towards preserving hospital capacity by increasing discharges from hospitals to skilled nursing facilities for COVID-19 positive patients. Temporary licensing fees were waived for retired or inactive nurses so they can re-enter the workforce. This same step last year cleared the way for more than 1,000 nurses and other health professionals to help out. Governor Little also says $30 million went towards expanded COVID-19 testing in K-12 schools to help minimize transmission. In Boise, Ariana Piper, CBS 2 News.